Okay, I got back from college early today, um, and I decided I'm going to make a tutorial after a few weeks. Um, bear with my voice, I recently had a throat infection, so that's messed up my voice a little bit. Okay, basically, this tutorial is about, and for all those people who say that the bootable USB tutorial isn't working. Well, I found an easier and foolproof solution that should work for anything, any operating system, and any USB stick as long as it's USB 2.0 and it's pretty fast it should be okay okay the program you need to get is called Novicore Winter Flash now this is the best bootable USB program I've ever come across in my life um, it's freeware so you can download it for free the links in the description um, you don't even need to install it you just right click extract here and yeah then you'll have it in a folder like this and then you want to open the executable application and it'll bring up the program very nifty program um, you can basically click welcome or task if you're not very familiar with stuff and you don't really want to edit anything if you just want to install windows on your netbook which is exactly what I wanted to do then just go on the welcome tab and click this uh, it'll begin the wizard and you want to click next you want to select your Windows disk under the top one and USB drive in that one and that's as simple as it is you click next and it will start like putting it onto your USB stick it will do all the boot stuff for you and yeah once it's done it will tell you and then you can install Windows on your netbook or laptop or whatever or on somebody else's computer and chances are it will be faster than disk because well it's flash memory so it's faster than a disk anyway so you can install things at blistering speeds well as fast as USB is going to go anyway so yeah and that's the best way to do it this program if it still doesn't work if it still doesn't work then contact me and I'll try and help you because there's another way you can do it if you're inside Vista but this requires command line and you know it's not very practical for everyone so yeah, um, the other tab in the program, uh, open it, is if you want to stop messing around with stuff, uh, which most people won't want to do, but if you do want to mess around then just go in there and have a look what you can do. Um, when you boot into your netbook, you obviously want to go into the BIOS and select the first boot device as flash, USB drive or whatever, and then it's going to boot up into it. Now you can have a lot of choices, it's going to say text mode, and it's going to say GUI mode or something like that and then it's going to have like five options click if uh, how.dll is giving you the error basically when I was installing XP on my Asus Aspire 1 I just clicked Acer Aspire 1 sorry not Asus Acer Aspire 1 I clicked text mode and XP installed perfect I don't know about Vista or Win 7 you might have to use GUI mode in fact you probably will but text mode works fine for Windows XP. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching. I hope it's helped. If you need any help, message me and I'll try and get back to your ASAP.